What's up YouTubers? Surreal Rager here. Today I want to review the Tommy N64 controller. It's a third party controller that will run you around $12 or less on eBay. First off, let's talk about the look. The color is similar to the standard controller. The handles are cut off, so it's got like these nubs going on. It's got a different colored joystick and it also has the slow and turbo buttons. It has the same back, so it has the trigger button and the pack. Visually, it's very ugly. Like, this thing looks terrible. Honestly, the standard controller does not look that well. It doesn't it's not, it's not visually appealing. So this is definitely a downgrade in visual. Uh, let's talk about the feel. Honestly, I thought the nubs would leave your hands like hanging off. I'm thinking like I'm so used to the standard controller, it's going to feel different and very odd. But surprisingly, it feels very comfortable. I don't feel like my right hand is hanging off. Rather, if I was using my left hand, it also would not feel like my hands are falling off. So it's surprisingly comfortable. It uh, gave me no issues with any feel. The joystick is very tight. It returns to center very quickly. The buttons click loudly, so that can get very annoying to you and others around you. Other than that, it feels pretty good. I played Diddy Kong Racing with this and I thought it was great. The joystick was very helpful. Um, all buttons responsive, so that felt great. Would I recommend this? Well, if you're looking to save money, I would definitely recommend this. You can get over the fact that it clicks. You can get over the fact that it's not a licensed product because it'll get the job done. Now, I have not used the slow or turbo buttons, but I imagine they work as a standard slow and turbo buttons would work. I uh, really know not too many grips about this. Honestly, just it's just the clicking that bothers me. I really like that the nubs are cut off. So if you're looking for something more comfortable, yeah, grab this controller. It's under 12 bucks. It works. It gets the job done. Overall, pretty good. Uh, yes, I would recommend this. I would definitely recommend this. Uh, one, to save money. Uh, two, for something different. I mean, this is the first time I've ever seen one of these controllers. It was actually given to me by a coworker. So I got it for free. And I actually use this over my standard licensed controller. Uh, I do enjoy this, so I recommend this controller. What do you guys think? Do you have this controller? Have you tried it out? What are your thoughts and opinions? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.